Alborg CSP has created a world-first energy system for Sundrop Farms in the Australian desert. Sustainable, self-sufficient, and highly cost-effective. This is the future. The vision behind Alborg CSP and the passion lies in changing energy. Alborg CSP designs and delivers innovative renewable energy technologies with 19 operational plants and three projects under development in eight countries around the world. Alborg CSP is changing energy by accelerating the world's renewable energy transition, ultimately by making more competitive green energy solutions. Alborg CSP was contacted three and a half years ago by a couple of enthusiastic, passionate people who wanted to build a greenhouse here in Port Augusta. And they needed somebody to make a greenhouse work together with an energy plant, utilizing solar and uh, salt water. But the most important thing for us in selecting the right partner to build our solar energy and water system was a partner that had the depth from an engineering perspective and the multidisciplinary teams that can bring together power production and water production all from renewables, and Alborg CSP really provided that to Sundrop Farms. The Integrated Energy System is the first industrial-scale concentrated solar power technology enabling year-round horticultural activities in the Australian desert and contributing to the production of 17 million kilograms of sustainable tomatoes a year. This accounts for 15% of Australia's entire tomato market. The way that this system produces and stores its energy has been designed with minimum maintenance and operational costs in mind. There's 23,000 mirrors in the field behind us which focus on a tower which is 127 meters tall, produces intense heat which we then use to desalinate the water which is taken from the Spencer Gulf. Uh, it's stored as heat which is used to heat the greenhouses and then to run the steam turbine which produces the electricity. The integrated energy system is about creating a transition towards another world which relies more on renewable than on fossil because that's going to help the environment. The key here is to lower the cost. The sun delivers more energy to Earth in an hour than we use in a year from other resources combined. You can almost conclude and say, wherever there's salt water and a lot of sun, there's a basis for building these kinds of plants and that's a big part of the world.